Hello. Hi. Happy Sunday. Hi, Existential Dorito. Thank you for that tip. Maybe I should add it to the starting soon screen. Thank you. Hey, Peter. Hello. Hi, Rex. Hi, Singularity. Hello, Emil. Hi, Tall Geese. Hello. It's so nice to see you. Happy Sunday. I hope everyone is having a nice weekend. Hello. Yo, Singularity, I picked up that free game and... So I'm also going to get Dragon Age because I saw it was like really, really, really inexpensive. But yes, oh my gosh, there's so many good games on sale right now. So thank you for putting that. Yo, Limey! So we're going to be checking out a game. Hi, everyone. I am, oh gosh, okay. I'm so happy to be able to present to you a game that is currently in development. And of course you all know, it's really important to me to showcase and feature indie developers, help get the word out there that there are great games being developed because indie developers are like the lifeblood of game development. Like seriously, they do so much and they put their whole heart into games. So let's check out some very cool video games today. We're going to be playing a game called <laughs> Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. And also, if you want to wishlist the game yourself, which it comes out next year in 2025, the link is pinned to the chat. I'm just going to test out the link myself and make sure that it works. It sure does. Okay, perfect. Um, so that's what we're going to be playing today. Hi, JB. Hello. Oh, probably all of them. Hi, Tricky. No, not Reggie fils -Aimé. Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, is most likely the end of the world. Yeah, so let's take a look. Hi, Gonzo Cookie. Hello. Thanks. Thank you so much for coming in and having notifications on and coming to check out this awesome game. So I got a chance to actually speak with the devs and get like a, like they showed me the demo for the game and showed me the mechanics and all the different ways you'll be able to play the game, which I think is really cool. So I wanted to share it with you. And the thing that I most love about it is the hand-drawn art style. The fact that you can manipulate gravity and there's different like ways to play it's really cool um hello hi hi rank hello good to see you oh my gosh existential dorito thank you so much for coming back i really appreciate that you found it on steam awesome singularity awesome yeah so let's take a look at the steam page we're also going to take a look at the trailer we're going to take a look at the website so y'all can see all the information that's out there. So yeah, let's let's take a look. I'm going to pause this music real quick so we can take a look at all the stuff. And um, yeah, so here is the Steam page. Oh dear. Wait, where did I go? Where's my picture? Oh, there I am. ha. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you like the vibes here. Thank you. That is so nice of you to say. That's a really great compliment. Thank you so much. And speaking of, I guess someone else who likes the vibes here, Bobby, she just walked in. She just walked in. I'm guessing she's going to jump up on the desk sometime soon. So this is Reggie, his cousin's two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. Basically, Reggie is a hero from the future, from the 16,000th century. There's a floof. Oh yeah, there's a floof. Wait, let me let me get her. I need my I need I look, I need my my partner um in crime here. Here's Bobby. Here she is. Hello. Um hello. Yeah, there's my girl. There's my girl. There she is. Hi Marto. Hello. Hi Black Richie Rich. Yeah. Oh, by the way, Congratulations to Black Richie Rich on first, Emil on second, and Rex Velator on third. Best stream. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is my girl. Wait, hold on. Let me show you. There she there she is. This is the catnip. Catnip. Yeah, she loves the catnip. I just fed her, so she's probably, yeah, her whiskers. She's probably gonna be 
chilling out because normally if um, she's hungry, she starts to jump all over the place and stuff. But yeah, <laughs> she's a funny girl. She's a funny girl. All right. So Queen Bobby is lovely. Oh, thank you. She appreciates that. Okay. So check out, this is the Steam page for Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. Control the direction of gravity as you run, jump, and explore in an outrageous time-traveling adventure as Reggie, an unlikely hero from the 16,000th century, on a mission to save scientists and ultimately the entire universe. So you've got the announcement trailer, some game screenshots here. Everything is like hand drawn. It's really beautiful. And the game is going to release in 2025. So hopefully um, by watching the stream and checking out the demo, it's something if you enjoy it, you can wishlist it yourself. Wishlisting really helps out developers. So if you see something you like, um, especially for like indie developers and stuff, make sure to go and wishlist it. Hi, ladies. Spookums. Nice to see you again. Hi, Nuke for Prez. Hello, Hellhound. Hello. Welcome, welcome. How are you today? It's very silly. I know. It's so cute. And that's why I was like, oh my gosh, we have to check this out because it's super duper cute. So um, here's the website for the game called ReggieGame.com. And I definitely want to look at the trailer, the story teaser, and the trailer, announcement trailer. Okay, let's take a look at this. Let's take a look at the trailer. Wait, let me make sure that this is not going to be too loud. Okay. Let's take a look at the trailer. Look at my future. Ruined again. Something's messing with history, but we cannot find what. Back to the past. Let's turn things around. Oh my gosh. I like this idea of controlling the gravity. I can't wait to see what that feels like with the controls. Which I'll be using an Xbox controller, by the way, to play this game. Run, jump, and explore across time! Okay, giant enemy crabs. Every video game has got to have giant enemy crabs, of course. We're on a ship. And then we're collecting... We're collecting stuff? This is so... I really like... Every level looks different, plays different, feels different. I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh. Giant enemy snakes too? Yeah, it's a very cool concept. My, I, my definite favorite thing so far is the visual style. Absolutely 100%. Chickens! Go on an adventure. A mind-bending adventure. I love it. With... Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. That was a really cool trailer. Don't try to mess with me. Kids these days. Poor commissaria. What <laughs> kids? These... Wait a minute. Was that Sonic at the end? Hold on. Was that Sonic at the end? That looked so funny. That's, oh my gosh. Okay. So there's a ton of cool videos here. Sonic the Hedgehog, Sonic and Mario cameo. Bro, yo, am amazing. Amazing. Hi, David. Hello, welcome. Okay, so that was really cool. The game has epic story with hilarious twists and must be seen to believe and unfolds through nearly an hour of fully animated and voiced cutscenes. Reggie travels through time and teams up with some unexpected allies to ensure that the scientific discoveries of the past remain intact to save the universe. Yo, okay, this is awesome. All right, well, let's get into the demo. Let's get into the demo. I love the title. It's so cute. It's so cute. I do too. Okay, and don't forget, if you want to wishlist it or check it out yourself, um, check out the Steam page, and it's pinned to the top of the chat. Also, you can follow them on Twitter to stay. You can follow them pretty much, I think, on all social media to stay up to date with, like, you know, the development process and you know, everything going on with the game, um, if you want to learn more, you know. So, let's take a look at the demo. Okay. 
How's the sound? More of a fan of the Oxford comma. All right, cool. Let me know if the game is loud or not loud enough. Bobby is sitting tight. She's excited to check out the game. Looks like the fling from Fling Smash. Oh my gosh. It does have a similar shape. It does. Okay. Full demo. Full demo. Hi, Corpus. Hello. Welcome. How are you? I hope you're having a nice day. Thank you so much for coming in. We're checking out a game called Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. It's in development right now, and it looks super cute, and it's got fully animated cutscenes. Yeah, I'm doing really well today. Thank you. Bobby's also hanging out with us. She's checking out the game. Thank you so much, Corpus. Thank you so much. I had a ton of fun celebrating um, all the black speedrunners for Juneteenth. They're continuing today. There's a second day today. So I'm going to have to go back and look at the VOD for the show. But yeah, that was really fun. Thank you for being there. Thank you so much. Okay, let's play the full demo. Also, how's the sound chat? Is it good? Previously on Reggie the Game. Psst. Want a free Mercedes? Okay. A free Mercedes? The black holes are Boring. visible. Extraterrestrial societies are death. The universe. Could you please leave the bloody dial alone? What? We're talking about interesting... The car is talking? The future as we know it will be destroyed. Our what? science is in danger. And make sure he does his job. Uh-oh. Wait, who does his job? Wait, make sure who? It could oh, go God. up. Okay. I mean, he is from the 16th century. Okay. That's true. I'm sure talking cars also transformer. I mean, it was a free Mercedes. Oh, wait, I think I'm being timed. Okay, let me pause the game here. <laughs> That's good. Hi, the volume's kind of low. That's good. Hi, Wessie. Hello. Oh, my gosh. Okay, awesome. All right, let's see what, what. Okay, so I'm using an Xbox controller if anybody's wondering. A buttons to jump. <laughs> the voice, oh! Okay, the trigger button. Okay, so the trigger button goes up and down. Okay, neat. Oh, I like, oh, okay. Can I jump on him? Oh, okay. I can jump on him. Wait, what's this? L. Oh, there was hidden stuff. Hi, Black Caesar. It's going great. We're playing this cute game called Reggie. And it's super, super awesome. I like looking for stuff in the ground. I like the jumping on the enemies part. I like the jumping on the enemies part. That's pretty cool. Jumping on the enemies with gravity. Wait, can I jump on you? Oh, hold on. I think I lost some health there. It said R, but I didn't. Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, we fell down in the pit anyway. Maybe another one will come up. Oh, I'm supposed to avoid him. Okay, I probably can't defeat him yet. Ow. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this is so cute. I like the background too. Okay, what's the X mean? Oh, is that my checkpoint? Okay, that's my checkpoint. Looks like Sonic meets Kirby. <laughs> Yo, it's super cute. Wait, okay, can I go? What happens if I do gravity when there's nothing to go onto? Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, well that. <laughs> All right. Well, don't go into don't go into outer space. <laughs> Wait, but how am I supposed to do it? 
Hold on! Am I supposed to continue to jump? <laughs> oh my god! Okay, wait. No! R! Oh, you're supposed to press R? Wait, but how do I get up there? Oh, you're supp- Oh, okay! So you're supposed to do- Okay, wait, wait. Let me show y'all what you're supposed to do. Okay. So you're supposed to use gravity, but then call yourself back before you go fully outside of space. That's how you get past that part. Wow. Okay. And then obviously, I'm guessing the opposite is true for this side. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting it. We're getting it. We're getting it. That was pretty funny, though. Not gonna lie. It's kind the the death scene is kind of hilarious. Oops. Hide underground. Okay. Maybe I'm just supposed to avoid. Just avoid, Ash. Just avoid. No! It's so sad. Like it's so he he died so tragically. Oh my god. That is so that is so funny. Okay. I like uh, I have to think about gravity. I have to literally think about gravity all the time. I don't think I don't know I don't know he went out with a bang. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know what I also like to wait a minute. Can we just talk about the fact that Reggie looks red kind of like an apple and the first level here the first level here right uh, we're in trees like we're falling like the falling apple on Sir Isaac Newton's head I wonder that can't be that can't be a coincidence right that can't be a coincidence I'm just saying. It looks like I'm an apple falling out of a tree. <laughs> Reggie wears apple bottom jeans. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, wait. Okay, cool. Just gonna avoid this time. No. Ash. Oh, that was extra health. Oh, nice. Can I jump? Oh, I'm guessing, okay. So, can I jump on them? You look kind of menacing. I don't know if I should jump on you. Okay. I really like the music, too. Looks more like a pom- It does- It does look kind of like a pomegranate. That's true. Hi, Pogo, by the way. Welcome. How you doing? We're checking out this indie game. This indie game called- Reggie, if you want to check it out yourself, the link is in the chat. Pinned to the top of chat. <laughs> it's very cute. It's very cute. Wait, can I jump on you? Nope. Okay, I have iframes though. Okay. I'm scared. I'm scared. Can I make it across this tree? Oh, I should probably go this way. Okay, my brain trying to figure out gravity. My brain trying to figure out gravity. I need a leaf. Nice. Thank you. Nice. That's what I said. That's what I said, Reggie. That's what I said. What do you all think of the art style so far? I really want that silver one. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that was pretty cool. Okay, let me see if I can figure this out. Okay, we all um, I almost got all of them. It's giving you a V V V V V V vibe for the flipping. Hi Duke! Hello! How you doing today? Duke, we're checking out this very cool, very cool Reggie indie sleep. game. Reggie the game. Okay. Sir Isaac Newton. I will call it. 
Gravency. Gravency? Come on! Reversion? Something's wrong with this timeline. Run! Hold on, you little homunculus. What's a homunculus? Ash said, Bobby. All right. I like that cutscene. Hi, right. telepathetic. Thank you so much. Oh, we're in England. Thank you so much for the tier one sub for 18 months, a year and a half. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Duke, I'm doing great. I hope you're having an awesome day. We are. So we're checking out this very, very cool indie game called Reggie. Wait, let me give you the full, the full, the full title. It's called Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. It's very good. It's very cute. And it's being developed right now. It comes out next year. That's the planned release. But the... But the... Um, this is my brain trying to do two things at once. It comes out next year. The Steam page is up. Also, make sure to go and check out Duke Donuts. Duke is very very awesome retro broadcaster and is a very very cool person super knowledgeable and um does a lot, a lot of really fun things on stream please make sure to go and check duke out thank you so much for coming by and i hope you're having a good weekend too what have you been working on lately what have you been up to and telepathetic thank you so much for the tier one sub for 18 months i really appreciate it so much I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for your support. And thanks for coming to check out this game. It's really super cute. You just wishlist. Let's go. Let's go. How do I say your name? Is it Intellion? Intellion? Thank you so much for doing that. Yo, is that the, re the, the real fire? Hello. How are you? Thanks so much for coming by and saying hello. What? No. Oh my god, I almost fell into outside space. I am a big fan of this hand-drawn art style. Uh-oh. I don't know. Something is afoot, chat. I don't know how I feel about this. There's something going on back there. Okay. Ooh! I almost fell down into the ground. Wait, I don't know what a death scene is if I fall into the pit yet. I'm kind of curious what that looks like. Not gonna lie. But I don't want... I don't want Reggie! I don't want to see a Reggie death scene. I had a wild week. Things are going amazing, but I slept in a little bit, yo. You played Morrowind yesterday! Let's freaking go. Oh my gosh. Yesterday... Yesterday, um... That is so awesome. I'm gonna have to go back and check out the VOD. Wait, 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 wait! Oh, the platforms are moving! Okay, I did not expect that. Okay, we have to get really good at moving the gravity. Oh, crud. Okay, I really like this. Because you really have to think of... So, it's... it. This is so cool! Wait, wait, wait! I, um... Okay, so you know how, like, in Super Mario 3, for example, you've got the moving levels? The auto moving levels this feels like that but like backwards you know what i mean like you have to think about moving yourself while everything else is moving but it makes it like you have to also take in consideration the the world around you oh my god no i keep forgetting to put myself back on gravity okay wait <laughs> Hey, fourth nobleman auto scrollers. Yes, thank you. Do you like the pause screen? I like that the pause screen looks like it's like tearing into the universe, right? Um Hello, hello, fourth nobleman. How are you doing? Welcome in. I hope you're having a nice day. I hope you're having a nice day. Thank you so much for coming to check out Reggie, by the way. You asked earlier, a homunculus is like a little Frankenstein, a small, typically artificially created humanoid being. I didn't even know that there was a word for that. I didn't even know that there was a word for that. That's I learned something new today. Oh, God, Reggie, please. 
Wait, there's so many rings up there. I want them. Oh, God, we're going to die. Okay. Wait, there's more here. Ay, ay, ay. Almost fell. Chad, I almost fell. Please give me all of the stuff to collect. No? I almost fell into outside space. There's more stuff to pick up here. Please give me all the stuff. What is this? Oh, an extra life! Oh, this is very cool. The screen rolls, but in, in repeat. Yeah, it's. I really like... Oh, God. I really like it. It's like platforming, but making my... Signing Stan? Hello, welcome! I hope I said your name right. Hello! How's it going? Thank you so much for the raid. Um, welcome in if you've never been here. I'm doing great! Yeah, thank you so much for the raid! How's it going? Um, we're playing an awesome game that's currently in development. Also, ads are gonna run, by the way, so we're gonna pause the game for ads. But, um, we're playing this awesome game that's currently in development called Reggie. And it's awesome. I got to talk to the devs. They showed me the demo. So I was like, oh, I want to share the demo with you all today. But what did you do on your broadcast? Thank you so much for choosing our channel to raid. Messages. We'll be right um, no, not that. Not that, Reggie Peter. Not that one. But, um, you know. Wait, hold on. Let me make sure you get a shout out there. There you go. What retro were you playing? Oh, that's so awesome. A bit of, I hope you had a good broadcast. Thank you. Thank you so much. So yeah, we've been playing this. And if you've never been here before, my name is Ash. And I play lots of retro games, lots of Nintendo games, lots of indie games with a retro vibe. Today we're checking out a super cool indie game that is currently in development today, which you can wishlist on Steam. The link is pinned to the top of chat if you want to wishlist it. You played your new game that's in beta. It's called Star Ka Ka Kadir. Combat class, and it's a tactical combat game in glorious four color CGA. Oh, that sounds really cool. Oh my gosh, I'd love to learn more about your game. That sounds really cool. I love it. I love it. We recently checked out a game called Whispers in the Moss that looked like it was like a BBS game, like it used like text to create the images and stuff. So that sounds really cool. You'll be setting up a web page for it soon. When you do, email it to me. My email is in my um, description. It's also in my Twitter bio. Yeah. You've seen Whispers in the Moss. It looks really cool. Hi, Knight. Hello. Good to see you. Welcome. I hope you're having a nice day. Yeah, so this game, this game, Reggie, is being developed right now. You know, I'm a big fan of showcasing, like, indie games and getting the, helping, you know, getting the word out there for um, developers who are creating games. So, yeah, make sure if you get a chance, send me an email so I can check it out when you, when you set it up. But, yeah, this game is really cool. This game is really cool. And the link... To the game is pinned to the top of chat if you want to wish list it yourself and check it out but yeah it's super duper cool and thank you so much for the raid that was really nice of you that was really nice of you yeah looks fun i dropped some mentions of it on my twitter okay awesome cool 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 nice okay so Let's see, let's see if I can get to the end of the stage here. Ooh, neat, wish listed it, nice! Hi, Grizzleby! Hello, super duper cool! Hi, Jared! Oh. I guess that's what happens when you fall into a pit. <laughs> oh, dear. That's what happens when you fall into a I'm sad. 
See, I mean, she already did. Black Caesar, she already did. She already did. She's been playing it. She's loving it, in fact. She is... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, wait. I just realized something. I don't have to... I thought I had to press different buttons to get the gravity going, but I can press the same button. No! Maybe every level has its own death scene. Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's enjoying it a lot. Okay. It seems that I lose all my... The things that I, I, uh, find. Okay, chat. Um, I think I need to lock in because I am not surviving those pits. Why? I didn't do that on purpose. I promise. I'm going to lose all my lives. I don't want a game over. Whoops. Okay. Go, 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 Ash. Go, go, go. <laughs> go, Reggie, go. Don't follow! Crip says hi. How are you? It was the character all this time. We're locking it. Hi, Goat Tongue. Hello. Hi, Dynamite. This game is so cute. It is so cute. I love the voice acting. I love the cutscenes. I love the hand-drawn animated style. Um, and the gravity. The gravity is like the biggest thing with the gameplay mechanics. As you can see. Trying to not die because of gravity. <laughs> it's hard. It's so tough. Oh my god. And I'm trying to collect everything. I'm being a loot goblin, but it's not working to my benefit. Being a loot goblin's not working to my benefit. Even the enemies are succumbing. Chi Chi, thank you so much. Hello, inner loot goblin intensifies. The death scene reminds you of Dragon's Lair. Welcome Raiders. Hi Chi Chi, hello. Uh, Soybean Raid. Thank you so much for the raid. Hi, Dune Boom Pow. Hi, GBZ. Thank you so much for thinking of us. I really appreciate you bringing your community on over. Right now, we're looking at an indie developed game. Um, it, this game is being developed right now. It comes out next year. It's called, wait, let me get you the title. Reggie, his cousin, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. That is so kind of you. What did you do on your broadcast? Let me make sure that you get a proper shout out. I hope you had a good time hanging out with Chi Chi. Thank you, thank you so much. I really appreciate you, you know, choosing us to come and hang out today. Thank you so much for trusting us with your community. I hope you had fun with Roblox. We are playing this really cool game. It's family friendly. It's cute. It's got really awesome cutscenes. The music and the voice acting is amazing. And you can. This game will be multiplayer when it comes out too. By the way, Minecraft and Roblox with the community. Lots of building. Oh, of course. Of course, my pleasure. I'm very happy to shout you out. Please, everyone, go and give Chi Chi a follow. Go and check them out. You know what's so funny? I've never played Minecraft before, but because it is the anniversary, I downloaded it. I bought it, and I downloaded it. So I might play it for the very first time, too. I've never, ever, ever played it before. So, yeah. So, But anyway, if you see this um, game today and you enjoy it make sure to click the link that's pinned to the top of chat and wish list it um the devs are working super hard on this game and um we're helping spread the word about it and i really love the animation the art style but oh my god this gravity does not love me i'm trying to figure out how to deal with the gravity and not die, basically, is what I'm trying to do. No, please. 
that's what I'm trying to do. So basically, for the story, Reggie is a time traveler from the 16th thousandth century. And we're back in time. And we're dealing with these gravity physics. Uh-oh. I think I'm running out of momentum. I'm gonna die. I think I have to use them for momentum. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Chad, I can't move forward anymore. Am I gonna die? I'm just out of range. Oh, there we go. That's we got the we got the momentum we needed. Oh my god, we got the momentum we needed. Thank you so much for the lurk. I appreciate that. Hi, Andrew. Welcome. Previously on Reggie the Game. The end of the universe. The oh, problem no. is much deeper than I thought. If we don't find a solution, the future as we know it will be destroyed. Now we sit for a snack? Hello? Black hole coming toward us? Which kind of science will we find at the new Gnomes University? Maybe their discoveries diverged from the science we knew. Given the current status of Gnome Country, I might lower my expectations. <laughs> yeah, I like... All right. Okay, we're in Spain now. We're in the year 1820. We're in Spain. Getting whole wholesome Rick and Morty vibes from this. Okay. I could see that. I could Rex, I could definitely see that. Yep. Yep. Uh-oh. Okay. How are we gonna get past that big old bubble? Uh-oh. He didn't like that. Uh-oh. Oh well. Alright, well you fell down there. Okay, so I can't I can't mess with gra I can't float through gravity forever you need something to give you momentum if you run out of momentum I like that I can also hide into the ground too I did not put two and two together that my momentum would my I didn't put two and two together that my momentum would slow down even though it totally makes sense that it should you know happy Sunday anime hero thank you thank you so much Thank you, thank you. Reggie and Morty's divergent journey. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Whee! I like that is a very, very satisfying pop sound for the bubble. Oops. Ash. Uh oh. I just noticed Reggie's face when you have really low health. It's kind of funny. Okay, I'm gonna wait for that bowl to get out of here. I need health. I'm hoping for health over here. Nope. Hide. Okay, please. Okay, he fell. Wait. <gasps> oh. If you die because you get hurt too much, he just walks out sad. Dag. The hide mechanic is a good idea. You'll love to see it. Okay, chat. I know this is going to sound kind of cruel, but I want to see what the death animation here is here. <laughs> okay, it's the same. I just want I just wanted to see if it was different. I just wanted to see he went back to Adventure Time. Oh my gosh. I just wanted to see if it was different. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Uh oh. Yeet. Okay. <laughs> Listen, sometimes you just gotta, you know, I gotta see. I'm curious. I'm a curious person. Whoops! Oh, poor thing. I meant to hide. I meant to hide! I didn't mean to press that button. I meant to hide. It's not looking good, chat. It's not looking good for me. 
Okay, hide. Boom. Okay, fall off the edge. How's that saying go again? Curiosity killed the Reggie or something like that? Yeah, yeah. Curiosity killed the Reggie. Sadly. But we had to find out. It was for science! It was for science. Like, literally. Bye, Reggie. Miss you, little guy! Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> no! No, I'm sad. Totally fine. We had to for science. I mean, isn't that what we... Isn't that, you know... The whole point of scientific in, ed, um, endeavors? Oh, no... Okay. Alright, alright, alright. I'm locked in. I'm locked in. No more mucking around with poor Reggie. No more mucking around. I like the whole... I like the chaining the enemies. I like chaining them. I, I really love that. That pop is so satisfying. Wait, I want to know what's in the ground over there. Okay, you go that way, right? And I'll go this way. Cool. Cool. Okay, let's see if we can... Oh. I didn't even notice that that would be a platform. I like how we can use him to... Destroy the enemies. I don't even have to do it. Okay. Let you run off. Okay. Go into gravity. It's so cool because normally in your brain, you want to jump across like everything. You want to jump to get to where you need to go. But the fact that... I have to do the opposite of jumping is what I really love. No, give me that. I need it. Ooh, nice. I really needed that. <laughs> we had no more lives. I haven't been interested in a platform in a while, so this looks very promising. Oh, that's so nice of you to say. Thank you so much for coming to check it out. Reggie's world revolves around science and bullfighting, apparently. 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 Uh-oh. He didn't like that. He didn't like being woken up. Sorry. Uh-oh, now we're gonna have two. Oh dear. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I'm supposed to use him to break the wall. Fascinating. Whoop! Whoops. It's not looking good for Reggie right now. Alright, good. Where's my, um... Okay, good. I haven't gotten to, like, a checkpoint. Okay, there's my checkpoint. I was like, where's my checkpoint? <gasps> oh, I'm gonna die! Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, now we have one that's up here. Almost fell into the ground. Wait, how am I supposed? Oh. Okay. I want to. I wanted to bop the enemies. I wanted to bop the enemies. This is so cool. Okay. This is so cool. Okay, watch out for. The oh, I thought those were definitely spikes that would have killed me. And I could totally jump over the bull. Okay, you broke that. Okay, now you can fall over there. I'm trying to... Oh, you could jump on him. Yeah. Crafting! Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome! How are you? Welcome in Raiders. If you've never been here, my name is Ash. I play retro games and Nintendo games. And today we are playing an indie game that's currently being developed called Reggie. Yeah, thank you so much. It was so nice of you to think of us. I really appreciate your time. What did you do today? What did you do on your broadcast? I hope it was fun. 
Thank you so much. Ooh, some Elden Ring. Let's go. Um, Elden Ring. I hope. Uh, have you been enjoying the DLC? Um, Elden Ring, but I'm a complete noob. So it's a new character. Oh, so you're like just starting. Oh, nice. Crafton only died once, says Dew Village. Per life. Oh. Wow. I don't even own the DLC yet, but definitely going to get it. I hope you enjoy the game. Um, my mom has been playing through the DLC. Zoo Village definitely isn't lying. I definitely died one, only once per life. Wow. 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 <laughs> well, it's so cool to see people getting into it brand new. Um, I am a new Elden Ring player myself. Like, I played the game only a handful of times. So my character is also still very, very new. But I am so glad that you're getting to enjoy it. It's such a beautiful game. But yes, so what we're doing here today, and everyone from my channel, please go and give Crafton a follow. Go and hang out with them during their Elden Ring journey. That sounds like it's going to be really fun to watch. You have about 40 hours in, but that was on launch, so it was lost on the character I made. A new one with my memory. It's basically a new game. Got it. 11 out of 10 death simulator. Yup, yup, yup. The bosses are tough, and the world is really interesting, and the story is good. So I hope you have fun. And if you've never been here, my name is Ash, and I play lots of retro games, Nintendo games, indie games with a retro vibe. Today, we're playing a game called Reggie, His Cousins. Two scientists and most likely the end of the world. And this game is currently in development. Um, I actually got to speak to the developers of this game and they showed me the demo and they were like, yeah, you want to stream it? Please let everyone know that this game is in development right now. It's super fun. It's family friendly. It's going to be multiplayer. There is a very cool physics mechanic that is like mainly how we control Reggie in the game. Reggie is from the 16,000th century and is, a t is time traveling back into the past to basically save the world and it's got um, over an hour of animated and fully voice acted cutscenes, which we have seen some of and it's really 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 cool it's really cool and I hope if you like it and you're enjoying what you're seeing today that you wishlist it because that really helps developers out it really helps new developers out so definitely check it out so basically I'm playing the game with an Xbox controller right now and using the R button, the R trigger, is how I'm moving between being on the ground and being in the air. And obviously, so we have to, okay, oops, that's not, okay, here's, poor Reggie. I should have made an exclamation, Reggie. Um, the link is pinned to the top of chat. The link is pinned to the top of chat. Okay, um, Reggie must take the passive route to eliminate enemies. He's lacking a Mega Man gun, like the pro proper time travel. Yeah, so here's the thing too, right? So you see me manipulating gravity, right? I can run out of momentum. So that is a key understanding here of how to get Reggie across where we need to go. Also, the death animation is hilarious. I don't want to... I only have two lives left. So I don't want to hit Reggie again. But uh, it's pretty funny. I don't know. I think it's hilarious. But I should totally make a Reggie command. That is a good point. That is a good point. Okay. Get past this part, please. So I'm wondering how I'm supposed to get past that part with the barbed wire. And I love how the profile picture changes if we're low on health. Okay. Okay. So let's figure out how we're supposed to do this. I did not. We've never seen that death animation. <laughs> oh, he got flattened. That's pretty sad. 
Not gonna lie. All of these are really funny. You can switch gravity instantly. So I'm pr look, check it out. Boom, 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 boom. It's literally with the press of the button, which is really cool. Whoops. That was almost deaf to me. Okay. But you can run out of momentum. Which is problematic if you need to get across. Oh, you know what I'm just noticing? I didn't even realize this. When you're pressing the gravity, the little... The gravity thing changes and gets smaller and smaller and changes color. That's how you know when you're running low on momentum. Oh! That is so smart. Okay, okay. Wait a minute. So check it out, chat. If I change gravity... Boom, 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 boom. See, it gets smaller. And it gets red. When you know you're running out. We like visual in Hi, Street! Hello! We love the visual indicator. That's true. I'm over here like a noob, not even paying attention. And now I know. You know what they say, momentum, mo problems. Wow. Chat wins again. Chat wins again. How you doing, Street? I hope you're having a nice weekend. Okay. Okay. And see that? Whoops. Okay, Ash. Well, how am I supposed to do this? Can I... Ooh. I'm trying to see if I can ride the, the bull. But I can't get close enough! I was trying to see if I could ride the bull. I was trying to see... I'm guessing that's what I need to do. But it was... It was really hard to land precisely on the bull. You know what I mean? This game is awesome. It's so much fun. I really like the hand-drawn art style. That is definitely my favorite aspect so far. And the the um, fully voiced cutscenes. Also, please make sure to go and check out my friend Street, by the way. Street streams here on Twitch. and Street, have you been playing Elden Ring? My mom has been playing Elden Ring and she loves the DLC. She loves it. Have you been playing the new Elden Ring game? Oh, Tekken 8. Nice. Nice. Oh, God. Reggie gonna be out on disability at the game release? I uh, know. I'm sorry. I keep, I keep injuring Reggie. You still need to beat the main... Yo, let me tell you what happened to my mom. So, I texted her the day that it released, right? And she was like... She was like... Yes, I finally got it. I'm going to start playing it right now. And so I was like, okay, awesome. So I didn't really think much of it. Then she texted me again talking about how she was mad because she accidentally started a new game plus and the game wouldn't let her start the DLC because she started a new game plus and didn't beat the bosses that she needed to beat. She was, I'm like, I got like five text messages in a row. And I was like, oh no, oh no, let me check it out. Let me Google. Let me make sure that there wasn't something you're supposed to like do or something. And she was, and then I looked it up and it was like, nah, you had to beat. You had to beat the boss. Whoops. And I was like, oh my God. No, Reggie! Oh, no! I was defeated! No, that sad cutscene! Wait, let me see. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Okay, so there's four. Okay, there's four levels in the demo. I can't. I can't. I cannot. Okay, we have to we have to do the full demo. 
Archie the game. I can't. Okay, this is gonna be good for anybody who just joined. Want a free Mercedes? Okay. Would you say no to a free Mercedes? The black holes are oh, visible. Wait. I can never imagine saying no to a free Mercedes. The universe. Could you please leave the bloody dial alone? We are talking about interesting theories here. The future. The title of this game needs more cowbell. <laughs> Make sure he does his job. So we need to make sure Sir Isaac Newton does his job. All right. Okay, we're starting back. We're back in the 17th century. Okay. Well, now that I know what to do, this should go a little smoother. This should go a little smoother. I wonder why the enemies look like cute little toys. Hi, Sharky! Hello! Welcome! How you doing? How you doing? Welcome. Okay, we just let you... We just let you go by. Okay. Because Reggie is secretly a monster. Am I the bad guy? Am I the bad... Am, am I the bad guy? Can't be. Yeah, this game is so awesome. It's currently being developed right now. And I got to chat with the devs. So we're showcasing the game today. The dolls walk the line. They have itchy butts. Wow. Okay, let's pause the game for let's pause the game for the ads. We're gonna pause here for the ads. Um yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. Wait a minute. Crafton, is that the... You're... Oh my gosh, you're going to Rotterdam? I hope you have fun. I really wish I could go to TwitchCon in Europe. Maybe next year, maybe one year. I'd love to go to TwitchCon in Europe. Definitely going to TwitchCon San Diego, though. You like the aesthetics? Yeah, all of it is hand-drawn, which is so cool. I love, love hand-drawn video games, you know? Last year, I met nice folks like Jerongo. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I'm so happy. I got to meet Jerongo at um, TwitchCon last year in Vegas. Yeah, the movement is really neat. Yeah. Thank you so much to the person that followed, by the way. Thank you so much. And all of, um, if you want to wishlist the game, the link is pinned to chat if you want to wishlist it. Also, Bobby is sleeping very sweetly in her chair, by the way. She's be I fed her right before the start of the stream, and she now is being a sweet girl and sleep. But she's wiggling her tail around because she knows I'm talking about her. Every time she knows I'm talking about her, she wiggles her tail. I see her. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for coming to check out this awesome game. Thank you so much. And now back, back to, our, to show. our show. Okay, back to our show. Okay. Okay, so we're switching gravity. Also, if I fall, if I fall into the sky, which sounds weird to say, we will get a hilarious death scene, which is pretty funny, but I will spare poor Reggie. Whoops. Oh, I didn't even realize that I could bop that one. Okay, I thought it would have been too big. Yeah. And I never heard of Crafton before the convention. And wait, wait, wait. And at the TwitchCon before I got to meet Crafton. We met over beers. You like the art style, Dan? It's so good. Wow. We never heard of each other or seen each other in chats, but we in were introduced by mutuals. Isn't that so funny how that works out? That is so funny. That's a big reason why I also love TwitchCon because it really connects people. It really does. I love that. That is so cool. That is so cool. And then he moved to the US. Wow. Hey, thank you so much to the person that followed. Thank you. Okay, boom jump over you. I want I want that. Okay. You have to be careful. 
You can't just use your gravity willy-nilly. Okay, boom. You imagine living in the US? <laughs> so you can't even attend Rotterdam. It was me, the dev of this game! Wow! Hello, welcome! Oh my gosh, we're having so much fun. Okay, so let me tell you what tragedy... Hello! This game is so fun. We also pinned the link to the top of chat so people can wishlist it. Let me tell you, I've been cracking up at these death animations and I totally didn't try some. I, t I totally didn't... I totally didn't uh, do some of them on purpose for science. <laughs> yeah! Thank you so much for coming by. Thank you. Thank you for coming by the stream. Gravency. Gravency. Come on! Graversion? Something's Graversion. wrong with this timeline. Run! Hold on, you little homunculus. Oh, so he was like, something's wrong with the timeline because he was not calling it gravity. Thank you so much. Way. Totally not intended. Totally. I totally didn't just let him fall into the sky for no reason so I could see what the death animation looked like. Don't hate the scientists, hate the method. Oh my gosh. But thank you so much for coming by. We're having a good time. We really love the art style, the music. The vibes, the storytelling. I'm getting used to learning about the gravity, understanding how to move. And you know what we really liked too? That I learned? Day of the Te Oh my god, Day of the Tentacle is one of my favorite video games. So I totally see it with the animation, the cutscenes. Yes, totally. So what one thing that I really love is if you're using your gravity power too much. You can see the indicator there change color to know if we're running out of power. And I was like, yo, that is so big brain. That is so big brain. I love that. The visual indicator. It's so good. Oh, God. Okay. No. Hello, Ash, please. I love this fluid method of moving and collecting. I'm a loot goblin, so I must collect everything. We must. Hi, Star-Lord, welcome. How you doing? Bop the enemies. Oh God, please. Please don't die, Reggie. Okay, we're at the checkpoint. That's good, which heals us. We needed that. We needed that. Jump. Run. Trying not to die. Moving along. Must collect everything. Must collect. Must collect. And am I going to make it to the end? Yes. And let's see what's underground here. Yes, treasure, treasure, treasure. <gasps> and an extra life. Let's go. Now we're going to use the toys to get continue to give us momentum. The enemy toys here. Oh! I strayed too far to the sun. I'm the same way. Got to collect all the loot, right? Star-Lord, got to collect all the loot. Please, Reggie, run. Please, Reggie, don't get caught. But yeah, if you want to wishlist this game, the link is pinned to the top of chat. Make sure to go and check it out. If you enjoy it. I love the extra life sound. Okay, awesome. Boom. Whoops. Okay. And this game will be two-player, which is really cool. Boom. I love it. Okay, this is where I messed up before. Because I didn't use them for momentum. Reggie, please. Before I got stuck there, because I didn't use them for momentum. 
preview. You went full Icarus. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna be. It's gonna have some cool multiplayer elements to it. Than I thought. If we don't find a solution, the future as we know it will be destroyed. Now we sit for a snack. Hello, black hole coming toward us. Which kind of science will we find at the new Gnomes University? Maybe their discoveries diverged from the science we knew. Given the current status of Gnome Country, I might lower my expectations. Gnome country. I love that. I love that little transition. Way. That transition animation is so good. This looks amazing. Yeah, it looks really awesome. It looks really, really awesome. I love it. And I love the music too, by the way. Okay, this is where we died before, chat. So hopefully... Hopefully I can get past this part. Oh my god. You went to your favorite restaurant with a friend, did chores, return. Nice. Nice, Star Lord. That's awesome. Sounds like a great day. Sounds like a really good day. Whoops. Okay. Poor Reggie. Sometimes I forget that I have to reverse gravity. Okay, go. Boom. Jump. Whoops. <laughs> um. Okay, my health is low. I don't know if there's health down there. I think there might be. I'm gonna let you go that way. Nope. There was no health to be found. Chat, there was no health to be found. Okay, let's see if I can get the bull to run off the side. Perfect. Boom. Maybe there's health over there. Oh my god. I totally almost died right there. Perfect. There we go. I would reverse gravity. Oh my gosh, nuke for Prez. Hello, welcome. Hello, hello. I hope you've been having a nice weekend, by the way. The bull fell. The bull fell. Off the edge. Boom. There we go. Okay. Oh, I woke him up and I don't think the bull liked that very much. Okay, there we go. Extra life. Let's go. We needed that. Another one. I wonder if the idea of Reggie hiding in the ground came from the French word for potato. Literally means apple of the earth. Yo, I like that idea. That maybe, maybe that could be the inspiration. Oops. Okay, wait. I have to be careful. My health is low. I used the weather to do some gardening. Oh, that sounds really nice. Um... My weekend has been going really nicely. I hosted on GDQ yesterday for the Juneteenth celebration. That was really fun. And um, got to hang out with lots of cool people. I mean, can't ask for more, to be honest. You know, it was a good time. Okay, I gotta be careful because my health is low. I'm trying to be safe. They didn't like that. Saw some of the GDQ. Awesome! Yeah, it was a good time. You know, um, Prez Noir did Super Mario World. Thor did um, Hades 2, the challenge run. And then Smith did Mario vs. Donkey Kong, which was really cool. So that was really fun to watch. It's really fun. I like how the bull falls off the edge. I want these rings. Okay. Jump. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. But I think there's some health coming up this way. Right there. I think there's some health right there. Whoops. 
Oh my god, I almost fell. Okay, I'm gonna hide right here. Pick up the health. That was close. Yes, you can fall into the sky. I have done so on many occasions. And the animation is kind of funny. The death animation is really funny. But I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try not to fall in on purpose. Fall up. But you could absolutely fall into the sky, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Health? Life. Perfect. Wait, what's... Ah! Well, there you go. That's what happens when you fall into the sky. That's what happens when you fall into the sky! <gasps> oh, tragedy! Tragedy! Oops. Ash. Wait, what's in here? Ooh, health. Perfect. Whoa. Hi, Game Master Rukia! Hello, welcome! Dwarves have that fear in Dragon Age? Oh my gosh. You know what's funny? Nuke for Prez, I saw, I think, I think I saw which Dragon Age is on sale on GOG for really cheap. I was thinking about getting it. I was thinking about getting it. It looked kind of cool. Tonight's Acme Night on Adult Swim is PB's Big Adventure. Oh, cool! Whee! Okay. Boom. Whoop! I like how we can use them to, um... Take out enemies. Boom. I don't even want to go for the rings. I'm scared! Okay. <laughs> and then there's an the extra life right here. Cool. Jump. Hi, Patry! Hello, hi, Balooey! Dragon Age Origins is my favorite. Yeah, it's 90% off at the moment. I think they're trying to gain some favor. After DA4... Oh, Dragon Age 4. Gotcha. Thinking of replaying it after you're done with Baldur's Gate 3, says Rex. Oh, thanks, Tall Geese. You had a good Saturday. You enjoyed the um, Juneteenth speedrunning challenge. The Juneteenth speedrunning celebration. That's awesome. Thank you so much for watching. This is really great. Yeah, it's awesome to support them. Okay, I don't want to... Hello? Oh, okay. I didn't get hurt there. Nice. <laughs> okay. Okay. Break the wall, break the wall, fall over, break the wall, fall over. Thank you. Do Patrick, I hope you're having a nice day. Bobby is here hanging out with me. She's sleeping on our chair. Okay. I need to get this. Whoops. At least we we made the um We made the Midway mark. So that's good. Okay, we have to use the bull to knock down this wall here. Boom, you fell. I get health. Perfect. Now is coming up the part that I kept dying soon. It's coming up. Okay, I need the bull to knock this over. Let's see if he falls over here. You are? Thanks. Good. I'm glad. Okay. The bull fell. 
So I want to go over here and see what's in here. Okay, cool. Now this is the part where I kept dying. Okay, let's see if I could... Whoops! I have to use the bull to regain my momentum. Poor bull. My problem will look it up for. Love the tactical combat, but they seem determined to leave everything I love about the origins. Also, thanks everyone for coming to hang out and checking out Reggie, which by the way, if you like what you're seeing here, you could definitely wishlist it on Steam. I really appreciate you taking the time out to come and check out this new game that's being developed right now. <gasps> <Whoa. laughs> no, I both of the those emojis fit. Both of those emojis fit. They're good. They're good. <laughs> you? Yep. Oh, I almost fell into the sky. I almost fell into the sky. That would have been very sad. Okay, I'm gonna get him to fall over here. Boom. Okay, now we have to... This is the hardest part I've encountered so far. No, oh. yeah. poor Reggie. Oh my God, please Reggie. We're running out of momentum. Okay. That was the end of the level, too? <gasps> Hi, Saito! Good to see you. Again, why is he always around? Uh, we're flatmates now. We screwed up the future again? Wow, I hadn't noticed anything strange. Here we go again. Congratulations, you have reached your destination. Who is supposed to enjoy the mathematical principles of natural philosophy in the middle of a sea? What? This game is very silly. All right. Level 23, year 3505, 36th century, North Esperantia, Earth. All right. Let's see what it's all about. Ash, any idea when you do another game show night? That's a good question. It's not really up to me. It's also up to how much content is available. So we pretty much ran through most of it. So I can reach out to them and see if they have any new game shows, but it also depends on how many are available. You know what I mean? So um, that's a good question. Let me reach out to them. So I'm not enthused about, oh, about Dragon Age, Baluie. Okay. It, yeah, it's still being developed. Exactly. Exactly. What is this? Uh-oh. Should I be afraid? Oh, don't touch it. Okay. I guess that's why they put that health there, because they knew we were going to try and touch it. I see what we have to do. Okay. No? Oh, God. No, I'm trying to get through the eyeball things. And they won't leave me alone. Okay. I'm gonna try and jump on them. Okay. Boom. They were they were not relenting. Yeah, they were not relenting. But yeah, that's a that was a that's a good question. Okay, cool. This level is already stressing me out. Okay. These enemies are really cute, though. But they're totally evil. Okay, I want all this. Thank you! No, don't put... Reggie! Don't put your finger in an outlet! Reggie! Come on! Why would you do that? 
Where are you even finding an outlet to put your finger in, by the way? Looks like Gleek from Hercule. Oh my god, yes, I know the Herculoids. Yup, I know the Herculoids. They used to show it on Cartoon Network. Oh my god, Reggie, please. Reggie, please. Okay. And more. Here come more. It's always the bats. The bat looking enemies, chat. Okay. It's always the bat looking enemies. For forgot about Gleek. Yeah. They used to show it on Cartoon Network. And it was like a family. It was like a family that lived. In, I don't I don't know if it was the past or the future. It must have been the future. Reggie is so cute. Although his little face, when you get hit, makes me feel sad. The little profile picture of his face looking sad. Okay. Whoopsie daisy. Why did I think that was going to work? Okay, let me take this enemy out. I don't want to take any... Come on! Reggie, please. Don't walk away so dejected. <laughs> there were barbarians in an apocalyptic future. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thundar. Yes, that's right. That's right. Okay. Dag, I forgot all about that. That's like back in the days when I used to watch like Top Cat. Which, did I hear correctly? Are they making a new Top Cat? I like the the enemy hit sound. Please leave me alone. Please. Don't you have somewhere else to go? Please leave me alone. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Just... Okay, good. Thank you. Okay. I used to watch that too. Yeah, the detective cat... Um... I don't think it was a detective, but they lived in the alleyway. They lived in an alleyway and it was a bunch of different cats. And they had like all different personalities. I don't know if he was a detective. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna wait. More of a uh, mob. Yeah, he was a mob cat. Woo Definitely almost died right there. Okay. They were not playing around with this level. I'm going to wait. I'm playing it safe, chat. I'm playing it safe. You can control gravity. Oh, word? Oh, no. Okay. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. My health is low. No! I thought I was gonna be able to do it. This level is challenging. Okay. Boom. Right here, there's health, but we don't need it. So they, oh, now we need it. Okay. Okay. Nice, I like that. I like that a lot. Boom. That was almost, that was bad. Okay. Another a cartoon that would air at odd hours. Snagglepuss? No, why? Not the pink panther. Health. Thank you. Okay, boom. Jump, jump. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Jump. Oh, the enemy got stuck. 
in the jelly, the pink jelly. Oh my god, why, Ash? Poor Reggie. Reggie's going through all these problems already. Why are you making his life so much harder? Okay, there we go. Jump, jump. Can't resist the loot. Must collect the loot. Jump on you, enemy. Collect the loot. Fly through, fly through gravity. Don't. Oh my god. Now we have to be careful. How many lives do I have? Eight? Okay. Boom. Hi, George! I'm doing wonderful today. How are you? We're playing a new game that's in development right, right now called Reggie. It's so cute. I love this game. This is this is currently being developed. It's um you can wish list it on Steam. And I love the little art style. Look at this little cute character. And it's got um fully voice acted cutscenes too, which is really awesome. Yeah, you're good too. And it's totally family friendly. It's adorable. Hi Edward. Hello. How you doing today? I hope you're having a nice day. I know the death scenes are hilarious. They're so funny. And I'm very curious why we're fighting. I'm very curious why we're fighting toys. Doing pretty good. Day is great. Yeah, everything is awesome. Everything is awesome. Yeah, we're playing as Reggie. Reggie is a time traveler who comes from the 16,000th century. He's, he's coming from the future, Reggie. Also, wait, Bobby. I need to wait. I need to bring Bobby closer to me because she's all the way over there. Hold on. She's all the way over there. She heard me. And there she is. I had to bring her closer. Chat, what should I have for dinners? I don't know what I want. Should I cook? Or should I order food? I should probably cook. I should probably cook, right? Hint, there's two hidden death scenes in this level we haven't seen yet. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so. Okay. Okay. You want tacos or pizza? Says Captain. Hello. How's the cat, Bobby? She's doing fine. You been wanting some jerk chicken? Oh, my God. I wish I could get that around here. Okay, two death scenes we haven't seen yet. So... I'm guessing it's not going to be floating into the and sky. Back to our show. It's not going to be floating into the sky. And we've had some death scenes where we were, where we touched the outlet, which is kind of funny. Maybe there's one with a particular kind of enemy. You know? It's got to be. Okay, boom. I'm playing it safe. I'm playing it safe, chat. Because... I want to see what happens if we get to the end of the level. I feel like one of the death scenes has got to be with these enemies. But I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Okay. Boom, boom. Okay, we're getting good. We're getting good. Nice. Good job, Reggie. That was unfortunate, but it's okay. We still have two health. Jump. How did you miss, Reggie? Reggie, I was betrayed. I was betrayed. And now this enemy is going to come after me, please. Please. Oh my god. 
scared. I'm scared. Chat. I don't see any in the sky. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, wait, 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 wait. We are in a cave. That's true. I want to see for science. Am I destroying the world? No, we're dusky. We're trying to save the world. Save the world. Not, not destroy. I want to see for science. Wait a minute, what is this? I didn't realize that we had a mechanic where we could do this. We could spin. What does that do? Okay, wait. Shallow fry, fry, shallow fry chicken. Ooh, that sounds good. Hi, Smith. Welcome. Okay, wait. I want to see what this death scene looks like. Ah! He gets stuck. Louis. I mean... <laughs> Hi, Smith Black. Luigi. Um, Reggie gets stuck in the sky. I mean, in the, in the cave ceiling. Poor Reggie. We had to look for science, okay? We had to look for science. We had to see. How you doing? Good job on your run on um on GDQ yesterday. You did such a great job. Oh god. Okay. We had to. You're great. That's good to hear. Smith did a run yesterday on GDQ for Juneteenth, which was awesome. And it was for Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Oops. It was for Mario vs. Donkey Kong. It was really fun. We had a good time. You found the cable. Yo, that's awesome. I'm glad um, you don't have to order a new one. Because sometimes those things can be expensive. You know? Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Any percent for the next event. Let's go. Yeah, make sure to go and check out uh, Smith's channel. Smith does a lot of speed running, not just for Mario vs. Donkey Kong, but also for the that Mario 64 game, which is really fun to watch. No, any percent. Gotcha, gotcha. Oops, I was looking at chat. I was looking at chat. There's a new DLC for any percent. Nice. Next time I play d and I'm, I'm saying it's not murder, it's science. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, it really is. Especially in d and You gotta test things out. The DM has to test things out. It's not murder, it's for science. You know? You did an awesome three-part commentary. Thank you, Tall Geese. That was really nice of you. Thank you so much. I mean, seriously. Boom. And boom. Perfect. Now here's the part that I've been struggling with. I'm going to wait for these enemies to come over. So that way we can jump on them. Boom. Take the safe way. Boom. Hide. Please. Oh, they stop moving when you hide. <gasps> That is so evil. They stop moving when you hide. Okay. Okay, we got an... Some... This is not good. Oh my god. I can't believe it. Okay. Uh-oh, I see a new mechanic. Okay, we have not gotten this far yet. Can I switch gravity? Oh, I totally can. That's cool. Oh my god, I almost freaking I almost freaking fell. I almost freaking fell there. Please, Reggie, please. Okay. <laughs> I finally see the midway point. Reggie, please. No, 
I can't believe it. Oh, that was a big fail. No. No. J Fries, hello. Oceanic, thank you for the hydrate. So close yet so far. Okay. At least we know. At least we know it's like right there. Yeah, I'm having a good Sunday. How are you? Thanks for coming by to check out Reggie. Thank you so much. Yeah, J Fries, how you feeling? I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by. This game is super cute. I'm a big fan of this gravity thing. Whee! Come on, Reggie, please. Please. There we go. Boom. There we go. Boom. Okay. Um, this is not looking good. This is not looking good. Oh my god, please. We have no more momentum. I'm gonna die. Finished chores, nice. Yo. Are you having cocoa puffs? Oh my gosh. They're chocolatey and delicious. Yeah, I have a hard time with really sugary cereals now too. Okay, I feel you on that. Like I love Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but I can't have it every day, you know? We have to play it safe because these enemies. Okay, going here, boom. I miss Cocoa Puffs. This game looks sick, yo. Hello, Dinglehorns, hello, welcome. I have the mini wheats. Oh my gosh, I love mini wheat. Honey Nut Cheerios, yeah. This game looks like a cooler, cuter version of Kirby, but funnier and cooler. So Micro, hello, welcome. This is a game called Reggie, his cousins, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. It's currently in development right now. The link for the game is pinned to the top of the chat. I will repost it here. But it is so cute, and it's got over an hour of fully voice-acted cutscenes. Everything is hand-drawn animation, and it is so awesome. So if you want to wishlist it, wishlist it on Steam. I'm just a huge fan of the art style, and the music is really, really cute. So I just, I love it. It's really silly. And it's going to have, like, some multiplayer aspects, which is really cool. Yeah, wishlist the heck out of this game. Like, seriously, anytime. Wishlisting games on Steam really, really, really helps support devs and stuff. Indie devs. So please, if you ever see games that you really love, make sure to wishlist them on Steam. Yeah! I'm a pre-order day one. This looks like my jam. It's so cute. And look at how freaking cute Reggie is. Oops. Please, Reggie, please. I need you to survive. Like, seriously. I need you to survive. We're gonna have to play it safe. I need to be locked in. I need to lock in. Oh my god, Reggie, please. If they are available. Yeah, wish listing really helps. Reggie looks like a baller. I Reggie is so cute. Yeah, wish listing and then also, um, yeah, it it because I think it helps bring their visibility, you know, to more people who like, like basically, I guess it's like, if you wishlist a game, then it probably gets recommended to people like, oh, if you like this game, you might like something similar or something like that. You know, I don't know exactly how it works. works. I'm guessing, I'm guessing, but that would be my guess. But they have specifically, not these developers, but developers in general have told me that wishlisting helps them a lot. It really helps them a lot. Super 80s Gamer has rated me 
thank you so much for the raid. Hi, Retcon Bro. Thank you so much. Hi, Julio. Hi, Mr. Stee J. Hello. What? Hello. It's so nice to see you all. PTP is here too. Thank you so much for the raid. Oh my gosh. What did you do, Super 80s? Thank you so, so, so much for thinking of us. We're playing a very cool indie game that's in development right now um, called Reggie, his cousins, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. That's what we're doing. And if you've never been here, my name is Ash, and I play retro games, Nintendo games, indie games with a retro vibe. And I really like this game because it has, like, a hand-drawn kind of cartoon, like, 80s, 90s cartoon kind of look. I was trying to work out the game before the raid. Yeah, so the game is currently being developed right now. The dev was actually in the chat earlier, um, and it was really cool. And, like, so every time we get, like, a death animation... <laughs> It's like super funny. So, yeah. But what were you doing? How was Command and Conquer? Everyone give Miss um give Super 80s Gamer a follow. Go and check out their channel especially because you know we love retro games here. I know you'll love hanging out there. Um you'll get to see lots of cool retro games and thank you for thinking of us. That was really kind of you. And it's nice to see you all. Great stream only multiplayer. Oh, I see. I see. So the main mechanic in this game, by the way, for everybody who just joined us, is gravity. So I'm pressing, I'm playing with my Xbox controller, and by pressing the shoulder button, it controls gravity. And that's basically... Oops. Reggie, please don't, don't touch outlets. That's, that's how we move throughout the game. That's like the main concept of the gameplay mechanic is this, this gravity feel yeah the graphics are awesome and there's over an hour of fully voiced cutscenes in the game and there's gonna be multiplayer too there's gonna be like multiplayer in this game so imagine being able to uh control gravity with your friends yeah a jetpack joyride yeah it's so cool and really fun and there was like um a level where platforms were moving and it felt it just felt a really fresh way a fresh perspective on platforming with the gravity having to think like not only do I have to jump from platform to platform but I have to land safely by reversing gravity oh thanks PTP that's awesome thank you so much for doing that yeah really I was just explaining before you all raided in, which thank you so much for doing that, that wishlisting games really helps the developers out. Yeah, the graphics are so fun. We were talking that these jelly things look like um, those um, characters from Thundar the Barbarian. Y'all remember that? Hanna-Barbera cartoon. We were saying that earlier. Okay, I'm trying to... I feel like that enemy was going to betray me, so I had to take him out. The Herculoids. Yes, thank you, Bluey. The Herculoids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Herculoids, not Thundar. Although th saying Thundar is very... Thundar is a fun name to say. <laughs> okay, I know there's another enemy coming up. Okay. This is to tell you how many times I've died on this area. I know that there was another enemy coming up. Boom. Yo, no problem, Super 80s. Yeah, oh, I hope you feel better. I'm so sorry to hear that you're feeling sick. Thank you for coming by. Health. Boom. Okay. I'm so sorry, but yeah, I hope you feel better. Boom. Okay. That was definitely more graceful than the last time. Yeah, see you next time. Definitely. Absolutely 100%. See you next time. Okay. We're going to go through here. Boom. Switch. Switch. No! I almost died right there. That would have been the end of me, chat.
we made it to the checkpoint finally. Oh my god, that was so tough. Okay, we're gonna run through. Please. Reggie. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much for the lurk. Thank you. We did it. We did it. We finally made it. Hi, Bad Arcane. We did it, Jay Fries. I'm so proud of myself. Yo, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Wouldn't it be fun if chat could also control gravity? I literally think I would cry if chat could control gravity. Because I know they would be trolling. They would be trolling me. They would be trolling me. It would be worse than crowd control. Would you get stuck playing for hours when it released? Yes! Yo! Yo, J Fries, thank you for the tier once over 37 months. Have you heard of crowd control? Yes. I yes. Love. Thank you so much, J Fries. That would be chaos. Dinglehorn, that would be chaos. For real, for real. I do love crowd control. We've used crowd control to raise money for charity many times. So it's been really, it's been a really awesome tool. But just in general, crowd control is really fun. Yeah, I am. I'm having a really great weekend. This has been so much fun. Okay. Let's start over here. I messed up. I messed up. Ash, please don't kill Reggie. Reggie's just trying to survive and save the world. You are not helping. You are not helping right now. Oh my goodness, I almost died there. Whoops. Oh, what is this? Oh my god. Church is the most important thing? Yeah, no, 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 no. Listen, it really, really is. And thank you for saying that. It really is super important, but yeah. Enjoy your lurk. We'll definitely talk soon. Thank you for coming to hang out with us. Okay, now how am I supposed to get through this? Okay. Um. Oh. Uh-oh. No, please. Reggie. The name of this game is solid. It's so good. I, okay, okay, chat, I have to lock in here. I have to lock in. Otherwise, I don't know if I'm gonna survive. Poor Reggie depends on me, and I'm over here, I'm over here gallivanting. Okay, locked in, locked in, we're locked in. It's such a good name, it really is. Oh my God, please, Reggie, please. Hello? Oh my god, I thought. I was gonna try and get that health over there. It's probably health in there. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Maybe I can get it. It's not even health! Oh my god, I was betrayed! I thought it was health! I was betrayed! Boom. Okay, I think I get the idea. I think I get the idea. Okay, boom. No, Reggie! I came here from Reggie Twitter shout out, but I've apparently been to your stream before. Oh my god! Well, thank you so much for coming back. Thank you so much. Yeah, that's really nice of you. Thanks for taking a chance and coming back. I'm, 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 I'm. Poor Reggie depends on me to help save the world. Reggie's depending on me to help save the world. And I'm like, la 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 la, what's gravity? What's gravity, hello? Okay, um, okay, I got Jebated last time. That's not health, so I'm not even gonna bother going down there. That was good. Welcome, Moon and Star, Star. To, this to this place. place. 
where destiny is made. made. You ever stream Sonic? Yes, I've streamed Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Sonic 3, Sonic Mania, Sonic Spinball. Uh, many Sonics. Many Sonics. I love Sonic. In fact, I have a few Sonics. Right here. And right here. And somewhere else there. Yeah. Yeah. So I missed the beginning, but what is Reggie supposed to be? Reggie's a time traveler from the 16,000th century. That's what we know so far. That's what we know so far. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if it's ever, like, explicitly stated yet. Maybe it'll be stated in the full game. Oh god, I don't know what to do here. Just pray for iframes, pretty much. Okay. Oh, I'm probably supposed to jump. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, yeah. Could be like a Rayman thingamajig? True, could be. Okay, this is gonna be different. Reggie, please. Oh. Health? Nice. Yes, nice. You'll love to see it. You like my shirt? Okay, wait, hold on. I have to I have to explain my shirt a little bit. This is artwork that Tawi made. Um, Tawi is this person right here, me, Chade, Phenomenon, Retro Island Gaming, and this is Zofar. I had to get this shirt. I had to. It's just too amazingly epic and awesome. So I had to. These are all wonderful broadcasters here on Twitch.tv that I have met. Everybody, no, I haven't met, I haven't gotten to meet Zofar, Tawi, or Chade, but I've gotten to meet Rig and Finn. Yeah, yeah, I was, I, so when Tawi made this, I was like, okay, we have to buy, I have to buy it. I have to support the artwork here. But thank you for asking. Okay, this is going to be very tough. Hello. Reggie, please. Reggie, Reggie, I really needed you to move forward just now. No! Sadata caught my attention. It's so good. Thank you. Thank you for asking. Chat, I have two lives. This is not good. I have game overed before. There is a level select in the demo, but... I really, I, I wanted to start from the beginning so you could see all the levels. Whoops. Okay. Okay. Gamer lock in mode. We got this. We got this. Exactly. We have to be locked in. We're locked in. We're locked in. Okay. We're locked in. Chat, we're gonna do this. Okay. Okay. I don't know why I didn't think to do this before. I just let myself get hit constantly. Okay. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go down there and get the health. Cool. It is cool. Okay, perfect. Locking in, locking in. Reggie, please. Okay, we did it. What? 
was that? Nope, nope. Oh, you spawn them? Those crystals can hurt me? Extra life. Chat, I was not ready. I was not ready for enemies that spawn other enemies. Does the game have voice cutscenes yet? Yes. We actually did get a chance to see some of them. Um, I will replay some, I will replay the intro, but yes, the game has over an hour of fully voice acted cutscenes and we have seen some so far. What is this? Uh, oh my God. Uh, how am I supposed to get through this? Please, Reggie, don't die. Oops. Yeah. That was sad. <laughs> I was doing so good too. I was really locked in. I was doing so good. I was doing so good. Ow. 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 I feel so sad every time Reggie, every time Reggie gets hurt. I feel so sad. <laughs> oh, ads are playing. Okay, let's pause for the ads. We're gonna pause for the ads, chat. Ads are running on Twitch right now. So for 90 seconds, we run ads every 90 second, every 30 minutes for 90 seconds. So that way anybody who joins the stream doesn't see a pre-roll. Also ads help support the channel. And, but we pause for ads so that way anyone who's not subscribed or doesn't have Twitch Turbo doesn't miss out on any gameplay. So that's why we pause for ads, by the way, if you're new here. Um, Bobby. It's also our let's check in on Bobby time. Let me check in on Bobby and give her a little scratch on the back. But yeah, I hope you've been enjoying Reggie. If you... Uh, yeah, we, we got to pause because not everybody can subscribe and watching ads does support the channel. So if you've been enjoying Reggie, please make sure to go and wishlist the game. Tell your friends yeah. about it. Yep, pause the game. There you go. Never thought about an ad pause. Yeah, you know, it's helpful. It's definitely helpful. But yeah, tell your friends Reggie's coming out, you know, and um, wishlist it. And follow them on socials so you can so you can see like you know updates about their development process. It's always really great to be able to support um, indie devs who are working really hard yeah, on very cool video show. games. Very very cool to be able to do that. Um, and welcome back. If you got hit with the ads, welcome back. We paused for ads so you didn't miss anything. So thank you for sitting through the ads. <laughs> Okay, I have to be careful because my health is low. Okay, jump. I'm gonna jump that way. Who's Reggie? Can you add them? Reggie is the character we're playing as in the game. That's the little the little character you see me playing as in the game. <gasps> what? That's unfortunate. Okay, chat. I've one more life to go. If I lose here, we game over. I'm gonna lock in. We're gonna lock in. All right. We got this. Boom. Perfect. Nuke for Prez. One life is enough. One life is all we need. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Nuke for Prez, for gifting a tier one sub to Retcon. What? Okay. I hope I'm saying your name right. Z Shisko. Thank you for the tier one sub. Thank you so much for the brand new tier one sub. Thank you. Enjoy your emotes and your ad free viewing. That's really, really awesome. Thank you so much. 
Also, by the way, chat, that's the developer. If you have any questions about the game. Thank you so much for allowing us to stream this amazing game. Thank you so much. Yeah. Enjoy your emotes and your ad-free viewing, retcon. No, no. Z Shis Z Shisko. I hope I'm saying your name right, by the way. Please let me know how to pronounce it if I'm saying it incorrectly. No. Please, Reggie, don't die. Yeah. Okay. Trying not to die here. Okay, boom. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. One life is all we need. Just Shisko. Okay, awesome. I almost died right there because um, we almost fell up into the cave ceiling. And that would have been terrible. I greedily tried to get the health. I greedily tried to get the health. Okay. All right, there we go. Yeah, the game is so cute. Okay. I'm gonna lock in. I'm gonna lock in, chat. I'm gonna lock in. Okay, right there. Boom. Okay, awesome. Enemies are coming up. Crystals. Please don't kill me. Life. Extra life. Boom. Ooh. <laughs> Is Reggie a turnip? Yes, question mark. <laughs> Not a turnip, not a turnip. Maybe we'll find out more when the game fully releases. Oh my goodness. Please, Reggie, don't die. I need you to survive because that's the end of the level. We did it! That was the full game! I beat the four levels. Oh my god. Okay, let me show you all. Hey, we did it. We did it. Let me show you all the cutscenes in the beginning. We beat the demo. We beat the demo. Thank you for the GGs. Thank you, thank you. Now you were all you were asking about cutscenes. Let's go, gamers. Let's go. Thank you for the GGs, everybody. Let me show you all the cutscenes. Check out the cutscenes in the beginning. On Reggie the game. Psst. Wanna free Mercedes? Yes. Okay. Who says no to that? The black holes are oh, visible. Way. Extraterrestrial societies are death to the universe. Could you please leave the bloody dial alone? We are talking about interesting theories here. The future as we know it will be destroyed. Our science is in danger. And make sure he does his job. So that was the big, that was the intro okay. cutscene for the demo. But of course, you know, I'm sure there's going to be lots of great story, lots of stuff going on. And there's going to be multiplayer. There's going to be, you know, over an hour of fully voice acted cutscenes. Everything is hand drawn. It's amazing. It's really fun, right, George? So if you want to wish list it, um let me put the link in chat. It's pinned to the top of chat, but I'm going to put the link in the chat again if you want to wish list it. And make sure to follow them on, you know, Twitter, Instagram, socials. Check out their website to stay up to date um, because this game is really cute. And I'm so glad we had the opportunity to not only stream the game, but talk to the dev. And, you know, um, I'm so glad that I got to share it with you all today. So it's really, it's so fun. It's so much fun. Yeah, thanks for, thanks for checking it out. Thank you so much for taking the time to check it out. Wait, what is B? Oh, B is the jump. Okay, okay. This is the first level. If you didn't get a chance to see the first level in the demo. Yeah, of course. I think it's so important to help devs showcase their hard work. Right? Like, that is so important. 
we have the opportunity to showcase things like this, we should. Okay, I'm gonna hide in the ground. See ya. Apple, gravity, newt. That's what I was saying, Patry. I was saying because th we're f literally falling out of a tree in the first level, right? And Newton is in the game. That's what I was saying. And look, you know, you see we're a little atom. And as we use gravity more and more, our atom changes color. I like the sound the eh, eh, when you're get when you're getting low to momentum. Yeah. I like that. I like it a lot. You cannot spam it forever. No. No, you cannot. And you you will lose momentum. You will fall and die if you don't... Oh, wait. There was a secret here? <gasps> there was an extra life there. I didn't know that. Yeah, you got to land for it to reset or you got to hit an enemy. If you hit an enemy, that also helps you reset. So this is what happens if you fall into eternity. If you if you don't control gravity and you just fall into space forever. You would have ate this up as a kid. It's so cute. Yeah, it is totally, totally like perfect for like family friendly moments. You know, if you want to play with your family. I agree. I think kids are going to love this game. The animation. The animation, absolutely. Secret here. Yeah. And I'm a loot goblin, so I love collecting everything. Whee! I love that there was a little extra life here. Nice. nice. Exactly. Nice. Now, why in Tarnation? Boom. So I, I can defeat that enemy by reversing gravity and landing on him. Boom. The defeating enemy sound is so satisfying. Speed Goblin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I feel like, I feel like this would be a fun game to speed run. Definitely, because especially with the way you move through the world with the with the physics, it would be really fun for that. Yeah, and the levels are beautiful and charming. I agree. I agree. Yeah, you could. D yes, stringing stuff together, especially when you combine it with running, the gravity. And Amiga Bill, hello? Thank you so much for the raid, Bill. Thank you so much. We're checking out a brand new game that's currently in development right now. Yo, Sigurd, thank you for the 25 bits. Graversion? Something's wrong with this timeline. Run! Hold on, you little homunculus. And I learned a new word today, homunculus. I learned a new a new word today, homunculus. Let me make sure to give my good friend Bill a shout out. Thank you so much. Bill does Sunday fun day streams every Sunday Amiga games. Bill is one of the nicest, coolest people I have ever met. Sep Lemon, thank you so much for the tier one sub for 41 41 months. 41 months. Time fully F. Time flieth. That's true. Time flieth. Sigurd, thank you for gigantifying an emote. Bill, thank you so much for the raid. Amiga Bill is a good friend. Streams Amiga games every Sunday, 2 p.m. Eastern time. Has one of the best communities. Hi, Jawolf. Hello, Cami. By the way, hello. Let me make sure to say hello to everybody who came in on the raid. Um, thank you. So Hi, Haze Maker. Hello, Hardly Worgen, Neil. Hello, everyone. Bill is the coolest. I love hanging out with Bill. Streams from Real Amigas. 
plays new Amiga games that have been um, that are being released, plays classic Amiga games, and is just one of the nicest people ever. The weather today is actually really beautiful. And thank you so much for the raid. Thank you. Thank you so much. I know I can't wait to hang out at WOG and LI Retro. Oh my gosh, it's going to be so much fun. Long Island Retro is going to be amazing. I'm going to be doing some really fun stuff that I can't wait to talk about, Bill. But yes, I will be there for all three days of Long Island Retro. Um, yes, and Amiga is awesome. Diggle Hortz, have you ever played Amiga? Voxel Trucks, thank you so much for the tier once over 33 months. Thank you. Um, so yes, please go and give Amiga Bill a follow and thank you so much for the raid. Yeah, thank you Cammy Bobby is he look she says hi. She sends a sleepy. Hello She says a sleepy. Hello Cammy a bit before my time, but I heard of it. Yes. Awesome. 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 Yeah, we play lots of Amiga games here, too, on Saturdays. So, you know, I hope we can share some Amiga love with you. Yeah, no problem. I understand it's late, Sep Lemon. Thank you so much um, for coming in on the raid. Thank you for the resub. Hi, Sanzoba! The last Long Island Retro. Yes, I know. Last year, right? Oh, my gosh. Yes, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to going again this year. Going to be doing some really cool things, and I can't wait. If you're going, I will be happy to see you there. Long Island Retro is amazing. Yeah, there's and there's Bobby. She woke up. Hi, Elmac. How you doing, by the way, if I didn't say hi? So, yes, so what we're doing today, Bill, is we're checking out an indie game that's currently in development called Reggie, His Cousin's two scientists and most likely the end of the world it is fully it's like fully hand-drawn it's got over an hour of vo fully voice acted cutscenes, and you control gravity in this game that's like the main physics of the game it's really cool if you're both going to be at long island retro and i'm not i now have envy sigur Oh my gosh, Sigur. Well, I'm glad that we got to meet at um, VCF East, though. That was really, really awesome. What's the kitty's name? Her name is Bobby. She's my sweet baby girl. And I love her very much. I love her very much. That's her name, Bobby. So, yeah. So, this game is currently being developed with a release date of 2025. If you like what you see, please make sure to wish list it. Thank you for gigantifying the Bobby emote, my favorite meow emote, of course. Um, but yeah, you can p click the link that's pinned to the top of chat if you want to wish list it. it. I, Sigur, I love it. In fact, I lowered the price because I love it so much. I want people to use it. I love it so much. I love, I love seeing people gigantify emotes. Yeah, it is new. They just released it maybe like a week or two ago. A week or two ago. Yeah. You love cats, Jaw Wolf? Me too. But yeah, they added that. It's called a Power Ups. And um, yeah, they released it recently. So it's a cool feature. There we go. I'm going through trying to collect everything. This is what I was telling y'all about. This really cool. We have to watch gravity. Instead of landing on platforms, we have to make sure we hover to them. This is really cool. Yeah, it's really dope. I love it. I love it. Wow. Blowing up lemmings. Of course we have to blow up lemmings here. Boom, boom, boom. I like that enemy chain. That was a good enemy chain. Good thing I just hit the... Good thing I just hit the... Um, <laughs> the midway mark. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the background. So there's something going on. I don't know what's going on in the story for this to be happening, but it's not good. It's not good. So, yeah. So in this demo, there are four levels that we got to take a look at. Hi, Dr. Poxy! Is that a member, Barry? No, it's Reggie. 
It's Reggie. Isn't Reggie cute? How you doing, Dr. Poxy? It's nice to see you. I know the death animation is hilarious. It's so funny. Don't you just hate it when black holes just spontaneously open up? Like, it's the bane of my existence. You know? Reggie the veggie. <laughs> nice to see you, Dr. Poxy. How you doing? Hi, Night Sprites. Hello. How are you? I'm going to go downstairs and cook mac and cheese. Oh, my God. That sounds so good. Okay. Thank you so much for coming in, Sigur. Thanks for gigantifying all those emotes. Oh, my gosh. I'll bring the headphones. Awesome. So, yeah. This game is currently being developed right now. It's super cute. Let me get that extra life. Let's go. And the main the main thing we're doing here is controlling gravity. Reggie is from the 16,000th century. And he's time traveling to save the universe, apparently. And Sir Isaac Newton is a part of the story too somehow. And he called me a humunculus. And I didn't know what that word meant until today. And we have to use enemies to... Whoops. Further our momentum. Right there. Boom. This game is gorgeous, right, Voxel? Okay. The end of the universe. The problem is much deeper than I thought. If we don't find a solution, the future as we know it will be destroyed. Now we sit for a snack? Hello? Black hole coming toward us? Which kind of science will we find at the new Gnomes University? Maybe their discoveries diverged from the science we knew. Given the current status of Gnome Country, I might lower my expectations. Wait a minute. Car Sagan? <laughs> wow! That is so funny. Don't mess with that berry. Simply stomps on giant enemies, hundreds of them bigger than himself. Car Sagan. Oh my god. That's too good, y'all. That's too good. That's too good. That is too good. So yeah, I can't wait. Do you think, do you think this demo will become available for people to download themselves and try out? Eventually? If someone wanted to download the demo and try out for, them, for themselves? I totally see, you know what? I totally see this game being a part of the Wholesome, wholesome Games Showcase. Um, Shisko. I totally see this game being a part of the, the Wholesome Games Showcase. Public demo in a few months with some new stuff. Let's go. That's why it's good to follow on social media so that way if you want to keep up to date with when this demo will be available it'll be good to follow um i think on twitter it's reggie game yeah oh no you got rejected three times oh i'm so sorry they probably get a lot of submissions that showcase has gotten so too violent oh wow I did not, I did not see that coming, sorry. Oh man, I'm sorry to hear about that. Okay, well maybe on Steam Next Fest. Steam Next Fest then. Maybe Steam Next Fest. Nah, just joking, but they said it's not wholesome enough. Oh, got you, got you. Yeah, Steam Next Fest. Yeah. Yeah! Stay tuned. Okay, we will. We will. Broom Hatter says, I got a shiny in a weird area in Pokemon where you rent them and return them. And I got a shiny Pokemon with one out of 8,192 odds. And I couldn't keep it. Wait a minute. So you can get shinies where you rent them and you can't keep it? That is very strange. What Pokemon was it, Broom Hatter? We're also playing this cool game called Reggie. 
The link is pinned to the top of chat. And um, Shisko is the dev for the game. And we're just taking a look at how cute and... Uh, oops. Oops. We're just taking a look at how cute and awesome the game is. And how funny the death scenes are. <laughs> oh dear. That was like some classic cartoon animation death scenes there. That was the thing. It was a Growlithe. Oh. I would have been sad too. I really like Growlithe. Yeah, this game is so much fun. It is so much fun. It's got fully voice acted cutscenes. And I really like controlling and manipulating gravity. And the art style is amazing. And I really like the music. Boom, boom. That was good. That was good. That was a good enemy chain right there. Very good enemy chain. And I like that. I like that the bull falls over the side. The art style is really cool, right? Wait, how come there's this? Wait a minute. What is this? Huh? Yo, Dinglehorn, to have a good one. Thank you so much. Yeah, take care. Thanks for being so awesome and super enthusiastic and bringing such great vibes over. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Have a good one. Yeah. Not the snot bubble. Here's a crazy thing. We're renting the entire hotel for this year's MAGFest. Ten minutes from the venue. Oh. Oh. Really? Okay, Voxel, I'm a, I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely keep that in mind. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna message you on Discord to learn more about that, because I definitely want to go back to Magfest a hundred percent for sure. I had so much fun last year. That bull is angry. Thank you so much for coming to hang out with me today, by the way, and checking out this awesome game. Ha -ha. Ha -ha. Let's go, Reggie. Let's go. Yeah. Nice to hang out for a bit. Thank you so much. Woo. Idro. Thank you for the tier one supper. 22 months. Thank you. Thank you so yeah. much. You. Thank you, Idro. How you doing? That's one hell of a game title. Reggie, his cousins, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world. It's very good. Very good. I... You reverse gravity. Yeah. So check it out. This is me reversing gravity. Jumping from top to bottom here. Oh, I had to wake this bull up here boom the sound effects are so satisfying side question what's the side question the official hotel tickets are wait are they did they already start did they already um start selling the tickets voxel it's been eight billion degrees outside oh my god because i have the I have the AC pumping, so it's cold. I'm cold. I should open up the window and warm it up in here. <laughs> Gravity mechanics remind you of Mario Galaxy. It's very awesome. <laughs> oh my gosh. But I hear you. It is. It is really, really hot. Okay, this is where I had problems last time. Don't let the Devil's Inferno. It's all lottery. Oh, I, I was able to get a room last year. 
but they haven't opened up the lottery yet, have they? I I was able to get in last year, and I was on the um, wait list. Just as long as they haven't like opened it up yet, because if they opened it up and I missed it, then that would be very frustrating. But I feel like I wouldn't have missed that information. Like they would email it out. But yeah, I'll let you know. Oh my god, that's how I died last time. And these enemies here. Okay, boom. You have to basically just touch... Just touch him. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. I like the flag at the end. Reggie the game. Again, why is he always around? Uh, we're flatmates now. We screwed up the future again? Wow, I hadn't noticed anything strange. Here we go again. <laughs> Wait, why was her new sticking his tongue out at Mona Lisa? Who is supposed to enjoy the mathematical principles of natural philosophy in the middle of a sea? Why was he sticking out his tongue at Mona Lisa? All right. That's that seemed kind of rude. And this is the last this is the last stage of the demo. Am I to have for dinner? I have no clue. I have no idea. Something good. To make her smile. Oh. We'll be right back to make her that makes so much sense. Yeah, it's a good demo. It's a good demo. So be on the lookout for if a new demo... May, that's why it's good to wishlist the game on Steam because then I'm sure they're going to announce when there's a demo for download. You're going to order a pizza? Oh my god, that sounds like a good idea. Pizza does sound like a good idea, to be honest with you. Oh man, should I order a pizza too? Hmm... You want to play this? I hope you enjoy. If you do get the chance to play it in the future, whenever it comes out, I'm always happy to hear about people's thoughts, you know, um, especially with games that we get to showcase. Beef and lamb. Oh, my God. I wish. I don't think there's any places around here to sell that oceanic. If there were, man, I would be for sure. This new Italian place called Papa John's Brooklyn style pizza. Nah, I, you know what, if it's coming from a chain, I tend to be like order like whatever their regular stuff is. Because whenever you get the specialty stuff, it never ends up being the same. I'm just going to wait till I go to Brooklyn to get Brooklyn style pizza, which will be um, when I go to Long Island Retro. <laughs> yeah, because like, you know, if you order from like Domino's or whatever, just get their regular stuff. I just get the regular stuff. And now, back to our show. All right. Thank you so much for sitting through the ads, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome back. We paused the game for you. Okay, let's see if I can get through this. Boom. Before, I was struggling. I struggled a lot with this level. Hello? Okay. Get the best pizza in New York. Exactly. 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 Boom, boom. Okay. I feel like I'm getting very good at this game. I feel like I'm getting very good. Boom. Whoops. I mean... I need practice. <laughs> I mean, I need practice. Rip. Exactly. Exactly. Oops. Once you think you've got it all figured out. Mm -mm. If you think you've got it all figured out. No, you don't. Yo. <laughs> I'm comedy timing. Yup, yup, yup. Yes. It's too good. You know, I thought about doing some stand-up comedy, but I would have to write a routine and... I don't know. 
I don't know. Yo, D. Lee, so this game right now is, um, you can wishlist it on Steam. I'm not sure if it's going to be available on consoles when it releases next year, but for now, we're playing the Steam version. So you can wishlist it on Steam for now. Oops. You can wishlist it with the link that's pinned to the top of chat. No, I'm gonna go after. I'm gonna go after I'm done streaming. I like to wait until it gets a little bit cooler outside. If I go anytime before like noon, it's gonna be too hot. Switch, PS4, PS5, Xbox, Xbox One, Series X. It's gonna be out on everything next year. Nice. Are they planning a GOG release? Oh, that's a good question too. That's a good question. I don't know. So Steam, Switch, PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, and X next year. You're studying GOG. Okay. Awesome. But you have lots of options there, chat. You have lots of... Oops. Lots of options there. Oh my god, they're coming for me. They are coming for me. Poor Reggie. Poor Reggie. I can't wait to see what boss battles are gonna look like. That's gonna be really fun to see boss battles. How we manipulate gravity for the bosses and stuff. I'm guessing the snake we saw in the trailer was probably a boss. We looked at the trailer before we started playing today. There's a cool there's some cool trailers on the website. Yeah. There were some cool trailers on the website. Woo. <gasps> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh, good thing the music for this is so chill and calm. Otherwise, I would be raging. Oh my god, Reggie, please. No, I didn't mean to do that. They're all coming after me. Please go away. Okay. No. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Don't fall into the cave ceiling. That's not good. Stay here. Collect all of these, please. Thank you. I'm going to defeat this little flying enemy before we go forward. Because I always... Oh, I thought I was going to land on the ceiling. I was wrong. I was wrong. I thought I was going to land on the ceiling. Oh, dear. Do, 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 do. Reggie, Reggie is so cute and loves to jump. No. Okay, boom. We won't die here because we are pros. Whoops. The ocean at the bottom of the cave. Oh, I did notice that. Now I'm noticing now that you said that. Huh. I wonder. Wait. Hmm. Listen, you can't talk too soon. Huh? Oh, there are many different cutscenes. Here's, here's another one for you. 
It depends on how you die, D. Lee. It depends on how you die. I keep dying the same way, so that's why I keep getting the same cutscene. But now you just saw three different cutscenes for death animation. <laughs> it's because I keep dying the same way. Oh no. I never saw the water one. The water one was too sad for me. He just gets stuck in the ceiling with a face. With a question mark, like, what did I do to deserve this? Like, what did I do? Oh no, that's okay, D. Lee. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, boom. Boom, 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 boom. One. All right. The Retro Scott, hello. How are you today? Welcome on in. It's so nice to have you. We're playing a game today. Yeah, we're playing a game today that's currently in development called Reggie. And it is all hand drawn. It's got some really cool cutscenes, fully voice acted cutscenes, over an hour of fully voice acted cutscenes. And, um,. The devs are in chat if you have any questions and if you want to wish list the game, it's pinned to the top of chat, but it's been so much fun to play. We basically are a being from the 16th century, the 16th thousandth century, and we're coming back in time to help save the world, pretty much. That's what we're doing. We had to come back in time. Mac and cheese has been cooked! Yo, Sigur, are you gonna have any mac and cheese yourself? Or is it just for the kids? I usually put hot sauce in my mac and cheese. So you must manipulate gravity. That's the whole game mechanic. That's really fun. Manipulating gravity. I'm not really a big fan. Got you, got you. That makes sense. That makes sense. Brings it as his lunch. Aww. I should try making some mac and cheese from scratch. I don't think I've ever tried to make it from scratch. Oops. Oh, God. I need health. But, yeah. Oh, this is just from a box. Got you, got you. The craft. I like that one. I like the Velveeta one too. I like that it comes with like the creamy cheese. Okay, I'm gonna stay right here. Boom. I think there's some health coming up. If I remember correctly. No, not yet. It was right there. The health was right there, chat. The health was right there. Oh, I'm on my last life. Boom, boom. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Come on, Ash. Poor Reggie's depending on you, and you're over here just letting him get hit by enemies. Okay, there we go. Whee! Whoops, I did not. Sh I, why did I do that? Liquid gold. It is called liquid gold. They call it liquid gold. That's true. They do call it that. Oops. Boom. Yep, yep, yep. Oops. I totally thought I was standing on the edge. I totally thought I was standing on the edge. I'm not even gonna go for that. I'm just gonna go forward. Oh! Oh, I think I have one more life. Oh, 
dip. I totally, totally, totally misjudged that jump. Thank goodness for iframes. Exactly. Exactly. It's not good. I gotta play this level safe because if I keep mucking around, I end up always, I end up getting hurt. I end up getting hurt. You know? Whoops. Okay. Boom. Okay, I'm not gonna go for that. Okay, we got two health. Play it safe. Play it safe. Jump, jump. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did that, chat. Because now I have to get through this without getting hurt. This part right here, which I believe there's enemies over there. Let me aggro them. I'm going to aggro them. Boom. Boom. Come over here. Boom. Okay. And I'm going to wait until that. to see the wow. game over screen oh my god it's a really fun mechanic switching gravity i think there was a game that used that before and i forgot what it was could be a mario game or something you play very well thank you tall geese we did at least we beat the demo at least once so that was good that was good this game is awesome. Nemo Runs. If you want to check it out yourself, um, the link to the game is pinned to top of chat, but I will put it in the chat again if you want to wish list it. Thank you for saying that, by the way. This game is awesome. And I hope you all get a chance to check it out um, and support the devs that are making it. Yeah, thank you so much for checking it out with me. But yeah. Reggie, his cousins, two scientists, and most likely the end of the world is going to come out next year. Uh, over an hour of fully voice acted cutscenes, fun gravity based mechanics. There will be multiplayer um, music that's amazing, hand drawn art style. They put their whole heart and love into this game, and I hope you enjoyed checking it out. Yeah! I could see an achievement being see every death scene. I like that, Baluey. I would try. I would try to do that. It, it would be like so sadistic to be like, oh, how many different ways can we kill Reggie to get all the different cutscenes? But I would totally do it. Hope you get it, the official. Yeah, 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 definitely, George. When this game comes out, I will definitely get the full, full version. Yeah. Oh, that's me. Listen, but the cutscenes are so good. We got to see them all. We have to make sure that the animators, you know, get all of their artwork seen. We need we need to see it. We need to see it. <laughs> you know? It's for science, Neil. It's for science. Honestly, it's for science, you know. So, yeah. Thanks for checking it out. I think I'm going to call it here, chat. Let's find a nice person to raid. What do you think? I hope you enjoyed that game. Can't wait. Great gameplay. Awesome. 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 Yeah, I'm going to probably take a walk and then eat. I'm probably going to take a walk and then eat. But yeah, thank you so much for checking out Reggie. Thank you so much to uh, Shisko for being in the chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so glad that um, you all were able to check out this game. I really loved show it, showing it off. Yeah, I really love showing it off. Thanks, King of APOC. Thanks, Oceanic Talgies. Yeah, thank you. It's been really great. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Thank you, Corpus. Today is Sunday, so we'll be live tomorrow on the GOG channel. Probably going to play some um, Baldur's Gate, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. And obviously, we'll be live in the evening for Oblivion. Yeah, thanks, Gonzo Cookie. We'll be live in the evening for Oblivion. 
for sure, for sure. That's going to be tomorrow. And yeah, make sure to go check out Reggie the game. Thank you for looking at this game with me today. Um, and there's some great videos for it on, on YouTube as well. So let's see. Who can we go say hi to? Zappy Zap tomorrow. Thank you, Jay Fries. Yeah, it should be really, really fun. It should be really, really fun tomorrow, of course. Let's go see who we can say hi to who is streaming on Twitch.tv. Thank you for hanging out with me. Here's my Discord if you want to jump in, say hi to me and all the lovely people who hang out in this chat every day. Thank you, D. Lee. Thanks, Nuke, for Prez. Here's my socials if you want to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, Threads, Blue Sky. And let's see here. We are looking for a person to raid. Here's the raid message. If you want to say hi to another lovely broadcaster, um, it's always really, really great to be able to say hi and brighten someone's day, you know? It's always nice to be able to brighten someone's day. Yeah, George. Toddy! Oh my gosh, that emote is too cute. Toddy, thanks for coming by and saying hi. George, I am done. Yes. And we're going to go say hi to somebody on Twitch. Let's go say hi to somebody on Twitch. Okay. Yeah, thank you, Retcon. Thank you. Thank you, Neil. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Y'all are the best. Y'all are the best. Okay, let's see here. We have some very good people streaming on Twitch.tv. Let's go hang out with my good friend, 8BitD, that I love very much, who is one of the sweetest and nicest people on the planet. Who is currently playing Final Fantasy IX, which I have never played before. Um, D is amazing. D loves Final Fantasy. D is so cool and is just one of the bestest. Yeah, thank you, George. Thank you so much. Take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks for always coming by and um and um, giving us your energy. We love D. I love D so much. So let's go say hi to 8-Bit D. There's the raid message chat. And I will see you tomorrow, okay? Take care of yourselves. Get some good rest. Don't forget to tell your friends Ash said hi. Bye-bye, everyone. Thanks, Ed. Thanks, George. Thanks, Retcon. Bye.